Well, construction is nearly complete on Lafayette's new IMAX theater. It is the final piece to a multi part renovation project. And as News 18's Valence Salivari reports, all three theaters have seen some changes. Lafayette's new IMAX will be a $5 million addition to Lafayette's theaters. The theater was in planning for some time, but management like Dan Laven could say the idea was originally limited. For a long time, we were blocked by the Indianapolis ones, by the mileage radius. Now that's been reduced, and so we were finally able to put one in. The IMAX is the final part of a revamp to Greater Lafayette's three theaters. Renovations have been ongoing for the past three years across town, bringing new amenities such as reclining seats and improved concessions to help improve the movie-going experience. You can watch movies at home, but it's such a different experience when you're watching it in a room full of people on a big screen and you really get the impact of the film. Goodrich Quality Theaters also upgraded Lafayette's other theaters. A new lobby and seats can be found inside Lafayette 7, and the exterior of Wabash Landing 9 was upgraded. The biggest upgrade of them all, the new 75 by 45 foot IMAX screen. It's upgrades like these that employees like Ali Cheney believe will bring new moviegoers. That just keeps the movie going experience more fresh. It just offers something new and exciting. And Cheney hopes the IMAX will be something everyone can enjoy. Cinema in general has just a very long and rich history, particularly with movie theaters and public screenings. And so we're just continuing that rich history of the way movies are really meant to be experienced. In Lafayette, Balance Lavari, News 18. The IMAX is set to open this weekend. A grand opening is scheduled for July.